All right, I wanted to give you an introduction to our Garmin Montana model, uh, model 680, that we're gonna be using in our techniques class. This is actually made to hold kind of horizontally like this, and it's got a touch screen. And so there's basically on this home page, there's two screens that we can go back and forth with the arrows here. That's the second screen and back to the first screen. So I just wanted to show you a few things on the screen. First of all, it already has our current location right here. And this is in UTM coordinates. We're in zone 14 here in eastern Nebraska. The top number is the easting, the 0697155. That's how many meters east of the western edge of zone 14, essentially. The bottom number is the northing. And this is how many meters north of the, literally how many meters north of the equator. So we're 4,519,418 meters north of the equator. So easting on the top, northing is the large number on the bottom. Um, it tells us our battery strength up there, and it also gives us the time of day. Now, if you wanted to see the satellite, spread that you're currently using to get that location that screen also will tell you your current location and it will show you the spread of satellites to the north and the south now that doesn't change so i'm actually to like to align this with north and south here i would actually need to shift my thing it always gives you north at the top but you can see that there is a variety of satellites and over to the left shows you the strength of each one of those satellites, the signal that's being received. And we need three or four of those to be giving us really good signal to be able to get a good, uh, good location. So we'll leave that screen by punching the X. There's a mark waypoint. We can punch that. If we wanted to mark a location, it would mark it as location number one, and we can just simply say save, okay? So that's like if you get to a spot and you wanna mark it to come back to later. The last thing I wanna show you is the setup function. It has several things and you can scroll with your thumb. You should leave those as they are. Whoa! If you go somewhere, this, this, this return button will take you back. There's units and the position format. Just in case you get this and you wanna to check to make sure that your position format is in UTMs, you come to this screen. If it wasn't in UTMs, you'd click that and you'd choose UTM UPS. Our datum is map datum WGS84. That's the model of the Earth's surface that we're using. And same thing with the map spheroid. So those are models of the Earth's surface, and this WGS84 is a pretty common model that, or of the Earth's surface that we'll use. All right, so those are the main features that will get us started, and you can at least tell where you are as soon as you turn on this unit. It gives you your locations. You can literally start walking north or south, and those numbers will change. So you don't even have to use a waypoint to find a location that I've given you for your assignment in class. You can just walk and until uh, those numbers get close to where uh, the, the to, to being right on top of what the waypoints are that I gave you for class.